Hey everyone, this is Sanam here from Alchemist Academy. Today we will be doing part two of the latest reorder questions. So let's start and let's do some new reorder questions. All right, everyone. So let's start with some latest reorder questions. Let's start solving them. Okay. We will quickly remember with reorders, the trick is always about scheming and scanning, identifying the topic sentence and trying to understand like what is the story of the reorder. All right. Let's have a look. He and his crew, Greenland trip, exploration. Okay, so it's about some kind of exploration, okay? Okay. About the ship discovery, Hudson left England in April 1610. He and his crew, that cannot be introduction after skirting. No, I would probably put this as my introduction here, okay? Uh, what happened? Like, what happened once they left your... Um, so what happened when they moved into, uh, they left England, okay. So he and his crew, which again included his, uh, his son, John and Robert Jewett, made their way across the Atlantic Ocean. Okay, I'll probably do this because uh, this is about he, who's this he? It's about Hudson left England. It's about this person called Hudson. Okay, then, okay, let's have a look. The exploration then reached another of his namesakes. Okay, another, the exploration then, okay. Mm, they crossed the Atlantic Ocean, made their way across the Atlantic Ocean. After skirting the southern tip of Greenland, they, they entered what became known as the Hudson Strait. Okay, so they is again referring to his, this, this thing, this crew, he and his crew. The exploration then reached another of his namesakes called the Hudson Bay. Okay, I think this should be the right way to do it. Okay. The two exchange photographs, correspondence with their husbands, she did. Okay, so it's about some person, okay, between a person and about probably two people. Okay. O'Keefe never formally recorded her theories about art. I think this should be introduction. Okay. So what happened next? If she did not record the theories about her heart, art, what happened next? How did she manage to keep a record of everything else? Okay. She did, however, leave a long trail of interviews and letters that reveal how she approached her painting practice and the rituals, experiences, and the environments that inspired her. So O'Keefe is this lady here. Okay. Then it says that the two exchange, who's this two? So there's no like there's no information about two people there, but this sentence does has this information correspondence with her husband and photographer Alfred Stiglitz in particular offers a raw, honest glimpse into O'Keefe's creative mind. The two exchange. This will be the next one. That's good. Okay, next. Moving forward. Now this is about. Uh, let's see, have a look. So this is about the children. This is about vaccines. This is about at least school. Okay, this is about schools and vaccines. Okay, so let's have a look. What exactly about schools and vaccine? Okay, vaccines are very important to this effort. Not cannot be introduction. They protect that cannot be for this reason. I think a healthy school gives students a healthy school setting gives all the students the best chance to learn and grow. Okay. Okay. Now, vaccines are very important to this effort. They protect the children. Okay. I would probably put this. Vaccines are very important to this effort. You want to give a healthy school setting and that vaccines are very important because of this. They protect children from getting and spreading diseases that can make them very sick. They, the vaccines, that is what is being referred to over here. Okay, so that is what they are being referred to with the vaccine part. Okay, so for this reason, we require the children aged two months to 18 years old who are entering or attending childcare, public school, or private school be vaccinated against certain diseases. Okay, this should be right. Okay, that's a weird one. Let's have a look. Bitcoins. Okay, Bitcoin, Bitcoin, mobile app. It's about Bitcoins. Okay. As we looked at it, it's about Bitcoins for sure. Uh, I would, okay, Bitcoin is an online money. Okay. 
this address can only be used one that's to say you need to download the mobile app to use such money whatever which is is a bitcoin address okay i think i'll go with this that's to say you need to download the mobile phone app to use such money okay because bitcoin is an online money okay now what we will go with this now one with uh this address can only be used for okay now i think with the above done it generates a bitcoin address so with the above done after you downloaded the app that's what it means and this address can only be used once address and this address if you look at it the object of this sentence has become the subject in the new sentence next okay now let's have a look at this so it's one point forward here fashion fashion it's about children's fashion what i can see from here it's about the children's fashion clothes okay so let's have a look at this okay since one point was founded over 40 years ago um uh da, da, da. but for france okay i'll probably go with this one during the past few years some of the world's biggest names in high end fashion have begun to see children's clothes as a promising sideline with which to extract more value from their main businesses there there means plural and there is referring to someone or a group of people okay uh i can see this Jean Paul Gaultier, Chloe and John Galliano have launched their children's clothes lines. Okay, I would go with this sentence, okay? This makes a lot more sense because they are main businesses, okay? But for since one one is one the Okay, I will go with this one. But for France's bond points making kids kids clothing is the main business. Since Bond Point was founded 40 years ago by clothes store owner Mary France and Bonnet Cohen, children and babies have been the center of the brand's development. I think this should be the next sentence. Okay, so let's have a look what happens. There were easy reorders. So as you can see, um, we did the reorders just with one read, and whatever answers we pick, we just finalize them. Okay, so this is how you should be doing your. reorders and mind it these orders reorders are the latest exam questions okay so good luck for your test and i hope that this helps you so i hope that you understood the reorders and it helped you a lot please make sure that when you doing your reorders choose your answers and do not change them keep practicing and good luck for your test